welcome back to my channel my name is T and on this channel we talk about nursing lifestyle self-care hauls I recently started a little cooking something so if you all are interested in seeing that type of content don't forget to hit that subscription button down below as well as turn on your post notification bell so you are notified anytime I post a new video okay so guys as you could tell in the title down below I have another nursing school video for you all and as you all know I graduated nursing school already but I just wanted to share some of the items that I utilize throughout my nursing school experience so yeah let's just jump right into the video okay also it's a lot of items we have to go through so I'm gonna start off with your bag obviously and you're gonna need something that's easy to wash easy to clean remember you'll be in and out of the hospital so you don't want anything that um, will be difficult to clean so this one I usually just throw it in the wash and wash it whenever I feel like it needs to clean so yeah that's it for this item then for the second item item you're obviously gonna need some pens and the most important ones are the black the red and the blue colored pens right because you're gonna need those for when you're documenting and so on then I have this pulse oximeter this is to test your SpO2 or blood oxygen levels it also is able to test the pulse and so on right so the hospital usually has them but I prefer to um, to get my own right so yeah so it just looks like this and you put it on your finger and you take the pulse and you take pulse and the SV2 levels with it so for the next item is this blood pressure cuff or a sphygmon manometer is what you call it and it came in this little case um, it also came in a box but I try with the box right so it looks like this this is the manual one and you're gonna need this to practice taking blood pressure manually you know usually in the hospital has the automatic ones but it's always good to practice taking it manually right then for the next item we have this utility scissors and this is it comes in handy for when you're doing dressings and them kind of thing so out of the packaging this, this is what it looks like you could see kind of slanted so it's easier to cut the material and so on and i just put um a little keychain on it because a lot of people had this exact scissors for some reason then the next thing that you're gonna need is a calculator and this is for when you are calculating like your drug dosages and all of those things your drip factor and all of those things so you're gonna need this this is important for when you're um, giving medication to your patient right so a small calculator that could fit in your pocket or so on then I just have this mark 2 inhaler and I highly recommend that you buy this and when you start your practical you will see why I'm telling you to buy this but just just get just get one of these a mark 2 inhaler right this is like essential oils in this thing so just make sure you pick up one of these right you will see why yes. then the next item now is face mask and this is necessary since you know when the covid started and all of that so face mask is necessary so i have a box shout out to cooper's pharmacy in maruga y'all this is where i buy my mask from that is where i get my mask so shout out to cooper's pharmacy in maruga go check them out and they're really really reasonable as well right so check them out cooper's pharmacy in maruga guys for your mask and all of that I would say this is a very important item for clinicals and it is just this little notebook guys I've had this book for from the beginning straight to the end of nursing school and this is a lifesaver this is just I just jotted down everything I heard all the new words you know new procedures that I didn't know and I went home and researched it went home and researched it and you just write it down and you keep this this is something you're gonna keep forever because I've been using this straight from the beginning to nursing, of nursing school straight to the end so get you a little notebook so that you could jot down what you need to jot down right this stethoscope and I got the Littman Classic 3 you don't have to get this one because this one was a little expensive I got this from Ayla Keys so um yeah the stethoscope as you can see and when you take it out of the box it looks like this yeah it's a little cute stethoscope and if you all notice that all my items are either black black and silver or black and pink that was my 
color scheme that I was trying to stick with when I bought all my nursing school items. So that's that for the stethoscope and this you're gonna need especially when you're using the manual blood pressure the cuff. The next item you're gonna need is a nurse's watch. A little backstory on this watch. I had um practical exams coming up right and my watch decided to conk out a week or two before I had exams so you see me searching now for a nurse's watch because you need it for when you have practical exams and I ended up stumbling on this page called Nursey KB on Instagram and I got this from them I just wanted to show you all now this was since July but I just wanted to show you all how cute this packaging was you all have to show you this when you take it out the titty post mailer it comes in a little bubble wrap and fold up neat 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 and cute and then as you take it when you open it you see this little card um, with all her information in this Ikea bag and this video is not sponsored I spent my own money to get this but it's also cute I just wanted to show you guys so this is her card and then in this little kind of it comes in this kind of little cute pull string bag and as I open it you'll see the nurse's watch packaged so beautifully on this little card and then she sent this little bone pen as a token guys this is so cute look at it I didn't pay for this this she sent on her own so um, thank you to Nursey Care Bear again this was since July but I love this so much guys but yeah next important item is a nurse's watch for the next item that I have now is a lunch kit and this is gonna be necessary because you're gonna be spending so much money on all your clinicals and your, your school fees and all of them thing you're gonna try to save your money as much as you can by carrying lunch so I have a little lunch kit here just a little Jansport lunch kit and then in the lunch kit is another important item that I have is a water bottle because it is important to drink your water every day especially when you're moving around drink your water as much as you can so I have this little cute pink water bottle here and for our next essential item is some hand sanitizer and as you all could see this bottle is almost empty because I use my sanitizer a lot and yeah so this is just the nature's collection coconut vanilla, vanilla coconut hand sanitizer and I carry this with me in my bag and then I have like these little mini bottles that I hold in my pocket I have one on my lunch kit if you all saw it there so yeah sanitizer is important and I always stock up on sanitizer I also bought like a bigger bottle so that I can refill the smaller ones so another right. thing that you have to get is a comfortable nursing shoes and I wouldn't show you all mine because mine is worn out but you have to get a very comfortable nursing shoes you have to get one with laces it has to be closed stored and you can't have no mesh or anything in it so get yourself a very something that you could you know walk around and utilize all day and that you'll be comfortable with wearing because you will be on your feet quite a lot and another thing is some people may require compression stockings right because again you'll be on your feet a lot another item is what we call a pinafore and that's the kind of white clotted material that you put over your uniform to prevent like getting messed up and stains and those kind of things so I'll insert a picture somewhere here or here for you guys to know exactly what is a pinafore so you need to get yourself one of these these really are relatively cheap you could pay $60 or something and get one sometimes you pay less See what so, you're gonna need y'all I know it's old but this is an ID badge holder I've had this for quite some time since I started this in school I had this ID badge holder so you're gonna need this because they ask for ID identification um, in the hospital quite a lot so remember to pick up an ID badge holder and walk with your ID when you are on your practical next thing is obviously an umbrella and you need this because sometimes when that rain decides to fall and you have no umbrella you're gonna regret it so get yourself a good umbrella I bought this one in Pennywise and I've had this for a little while maybe like two years now I've had this so yeah 
an umbrella then I have this little pen light set here now this isn't really that important because you hardly ever use these on the ward but in case you have to do like an assessment of a patient of a neurological patient it's always good to have the pen lights right so this is how they come it is a two-pack and I got this off of Amazon I cannot remember how much we paid for this it's just you know it lights up right so this you could use when you're doing neurological checks on a patient I had this book this is a dictionary of nursing and I bought this because this has all the little terms you need to know all the illnesses you know all the um, measurements all the conversion rates all the units everything it has in this book so I just I used to work with this on, on my clinicals because it always came in very handy now there are other books that you could check out but I recommend this one and it could fit in your pinafore so that you could work with it as well then I had this little measuring tape and you all might say that's not really essential but I didn't think that it was until I, I um, was on practical because they're gonna use this for like when you have to measure especially in the orthopedic ward like if people if someone needs like a walking stick or like crutches or something like that you're gonna use this to measure as well as when you're on the clinical rotation in the community when you have to measure the baby's head circumference and chest circumference and those kind of things it's always good to work with your own usually they have but it's always good to have your own as well so a little measuring tape it's good to have. now it depends on your school uniform but for us in Trinidad we have to wear stockings or pantyhose with our uniform so yeah I just buy this Mafia stockings and this is the best one that I've seen thus far it stays the longest you know it doesn't rip as easy usually I purchase the spice in it but you know yeah usually skin tone stockings but I have this little bag here now this isn't really an essential but I purchased this bag to put all my clinical stuff in so that it would be easy to access you know inside of my bag so I put my book I put my pens everything inside of this so it wouldn't be you know flying all over the place so yeah I just have this bag and this is my emergency kit and this has all my feminine products and some other things that you would need in the hospital or when you're on the go so get yourself one of these I think I might do a video to show exactly what I have in it so if you're interested in seeing what's in my emergency kit let me know down below and then again this goes with the uniform this is the nursing nurse's hat and this is something important because guys you'll get blowout if you don't wear this especially in the hospital they don't play with this this is uniform they don't play so ensure that you have your nurse's hat well, as well. I always carried like a folder in my bag for practicals because you know you have to fill out the time sheets and so on that you have to get signed to carry back to your school or the gate forms or so on I always put them in here I made copies and put them in here so that I always had them on me when I needed them so yeah a little folder and then one of my favorite items that I purchased for nursing school practical was this clipboard guys I love this so much look at this design you're gonna need this um, especially as you will be on the go a lot I recommend that you get yourself a clipboard right so yeah so that's it for all the items that I have in this haul so I know that was a lot of stuff right but if you all can get the items in one shot that's okay because I didn't buy everything immediately I started to you know collect these items as I went through nursing school because it is a little bit expensive that brings us to the end of this video once again thank you guys for watching and don't forget to like comment and subscribe down below as well as turn on your post notification so you know every time I post a new video and guys you can also comment and see what type of videos you all would want to see thank you guys for watching I'll see you guys in my next one bye